Hey guys, Iron Gate Studios Spotlight today on Valheim's Hearth and Home update was on new ingredient changes. They did in fact split raw meat into the three categories of deer meat, boar meat, and wolf meat, and obviously each of them will turn into their own cooked variant, and each of them will have a jerky recipe. They also showed off some planting of onions, which we already knew was coming, but you can see on the table as they approach in the early part of the video, they are going to have some type of onion soup. The cauldron will be altered in order to be more like the forge and the workbench and have upgrades with it, like pots and pans and the butcher's table, which makes it seem like we also will be increasing the quality of food like a lot of people have wanted as we upgrade our cauldron. It could be that we only unlock new recipes with higher upgraded cauldrons, but I'm hoping that we actually improve each individual food and make them work slightly different as we upgrade it. We also got a peek at the stone oven, which will bake the bread and the pies before you're allowed to eat them, which still indicates we will cook them in the cauldron and then have to put them in for the finishing process in the oven. It does only have four slots, which could be very tedious and annoying to micromanage if you're a bigger group of people. So hopefully the bread and the pie can actually get some pretty big bonuses to your health and stamina once you get an upgraded cauldron. And they also showed us the butte berries, which will allow you to eat them and throw up all the food you currently have, finally allowing us to reset what we ate without having to wait out the timers. This is a huge change for me, since I have been desperately wanting to be able to change what I ate depending on the situation I'm in. And they gave us a quick shot at the end of a bow shooting down a wolf, letting us know that their next video will be about the tweaks they have made to weapons. This should be a really important video, and I'm excited to see it to see what changes they have made to the weapons, no matter how small. You can check out the original video from Iron Gate in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.